The bibliographical test of any document, we're applying it to the New Testament. And the question is, how many manuscripts do you have? The more manuscripts you have, the easier it is to reconstruct the original. For example, if you have 20 manuscripts, and in those manuscripts you have the Gospel of John, but in John 3, 16, there's three different renderings in those manuscripts. Some translate, for God so loved the world. Some say God thought a lot about the world. And some say God thought the world was cool. How do you know what's in the original? You can't. It's impossible. However, if you have four or five hundred manuscripts, then, oh, it is so much easier to use those manuscripts to recreate the original to a high percentage of a pure text. Again, let me compare the number of manuscripts with other literature of antiquity. For example, Caesar and the Gallic Wars, there's only 10 manuscripts that survive. Of Plato, there's only seven manuscripts. Many people consider the Roman historian Tacitus the, the number one Roman historian, and yet there's only 20 manuscripts that remain of his annals. Of Pliny the Younger, seven manuscripts survive. Of Thucydides, eight manuscripts. Suetonius, eight manuscripts. Of the Greek historian Herodotus, there's only eight manuscripts that survive. Everything else is lost. Sophocles, there's 193. Of Lucretius, there is two. Of Euripides, nine manuscripts. Of Demosthenes, there's about 200 manuscripts. Now, Aristophanes, there's only 10, maybe 12 at the most. And Aristotle, only 49 manuscripts. Do you know what there is of the New Testament? Just of the New Testament? I've been able to document 24,633 manuscripts of just the New Testament. I never knew that until I set out to write evidence that demands a verdict against it and found out that I was wrong. I was dumb. The only problem is others were dumber. They made a movie out of that. Dumb and dumber. But in that whole process, I concluded there's absolutely no comparison in numbers between the New Testament and any other book in all of history.